Oh my god! Yo! Yo, I see, yo, I see those pigs. Yo, hold on. <laughs> we just sniped that cow. Yo, who won it? Yo, who, yo, you won it? Yo, I just killed the rest of your family. What's up? Yo, it's over. <laughs> Next entity. Back to another video, and today I'm going to be going over how to get mods for the Minecraft Xbox One Edition. My old video with over 200,000 views explaining this is actually kind of obsolete now because there's a brand new application that does what I was doing in that video way more easier. Plus, this is 100% free. So, let's go to jump right into the tutorial on how to get mods for Minecraft Xbox One. So in order to go ahead and do this tutorial, it's actually very simple. You're going to need three different things. You're going to need Minecraft for the Xbox One Edition, as you can see right here. And if you guys are watching this video, you probably already own it. Then you're going to need Microsoft Edge. This comes pre-installed with your Xbox One console. And last but not least, you're going to need MC Add-on Manager. This is a brand new application that actually allows you to go ahead and import MC Pack files and MC Add-on files. So to go ahead and get it, go ahead and press Y on your home screen, just like that. Then type in MC, then space, and then add-on, and it should appear just like that. So MC space A, and it will appear. And since I already have it installed, it's going to go ahead and open for me. So just go ahead and install this application. Once you guys have it open, you're going to see five different tabs. One for the creators of this wonderful application. Then we have realms. It will display every single world that you have. You can go ahead and select from a bunch of different features such as deleting them, exporting them to an external USB flash drive, which is actually super helpful. And you can also import MC world files, which we will get into another day. Right here is actually the resource pack folder. And this is what we're going to be using for today to install these mods. We also have behavior packs, which is actually how the mods run and how everything operates. And also, last but not least, we have skin packs. So, the next step, you guys are probably wondering, how do you get the mods? So, head over to Microsoft Edge right here, and you will actually need to head over to this website called mcpedl.com. This website is actually super clean and super slick, as you guys can see. Take a look at this. So this is actually the interface of it. It has mods, it has seeds, it has skin packs, and this is the homepage right here. It's actually super clean, and I definitely recommend coming here because it's updated every single day. If we go ahead and head back to the mods section where we were just at, this is actually add-ons, by the way. You guys will see a bunch of different add-ons, and just for your information, fun fact, Basically, this is the second page, and right here is the Golems add-on, but I just saw this as the newest one basically 14 hours ago, so they actually added about 20 more add-ons when I was sleeping, which is actually crazy. But if you want to go ahead and search for something, let's say mutant creatures, but we're going to be getting today's actual guns, so go ahead and go to the search bar right here and type in what you need. So the mod that I'm going to be installing today is Actual Guns. This mod adds in a bunch of different guns into your Minecraft world and in general it's just super fun to use them. So when clicking on this you guys will be greeted with this very very cool thing which is actually the Actual Guns add-on. They have 3D models, this is actually pretty cool and I definitely recommend it. It's gonna take a while for this stuff to go ahead and load in, but they have sniper rifles, a bunch of different guns, just keep scrolling, explosives, and everything that you could possibly be looking for. So let's go ahead and click on the temporary download link. I'm not too sure if it's gonna be like that forever, but let's go ahead and click on this real quick, and we should actually be able to go ahead and get the mod. So that was super easy, but keep in mind, guys, they're gonna come across some that require AdFly, which is actually super annoying. I really do hate AdFly, in my personal opinion, especially on the Xbox, because we just can't get around it whatsoever. But as you can see, I just installed it. So I'm gonna go to meet you guys on the MC Add-on Manager right here. This is actually pretty cool how easy this is. So instead of going to Ruins, go over to Resource Packs and take a look at how easy this is. So take a look 
put in imports and you want to go ahead and actually install actual guns right here actual guns 3d it's going to go to an import take a look at the bottom left it's actually circling around importing and you guys should be good to go one eternity later so it took about a minute to go ahead and install but that's not a problem smaller add-ons will actually be easier to go ahead and do so and also i do recommend going ahead and deleting the source file that's just the mc add-on file that you just use so click on yes and it did it so now we have actual guns resource pack and behavior pack so keep this in mind guys and one thing i do may want to go ahead and mention I don't know if this is actually true, but I did try to go ahead and install the new Mutant Creatures add-on. And since I already took a look at it before in this video, I think you have to delete your cache data just in case. But you guys will see what I mean. But if you guys want to go ahead and see this mod in action, go ahead and make sure Minecraft was closed. I already did so and load it up. And I'll meet you guys in the game. So when you guys load up Minecraft, go ahead and click on play and go ahead and create a brand new world or you guys can use a pre-existing one for this video i'm going to use a pre-existing one because it's a little bit easier so go ahead and click on here go ahead and also go to my packs and take a look we got actual guns pretty cool stuff also remember guys that you may actually do need experimental gameplay just take a look at the add-on description because it would tell you but once you guys have everything added onto your world, go ahead and press play, and guns will be added into your Minecraft experience. Okay, so if you want to go ahead and give yourself guns, there's a bunch of different commands on the MCPDL page of this. I'm going to give myself an AR. Take a look at this. There's no way. We have an actual gun. There's no... <laughs> There's no way, and then look, when we actually start running, this is actually pretty cool, so it actually kind of crouches. Oh, so look at this, look at this, look at this. <laughs> oh my oh goodness, wait, no. who else wanted it? <laughs> you wanted to? Hold on. Who else, who else? Yo, I'm on a rampage. Yo, who else? Oh, it's over. All right, so as you can see, these sheeps and everything else just did not stand a chance. This is actually a pretty cool add-on that I definitely recommend going ahead and picking it up. We also have grenades on here. These are 3D models on Minecraft Bedrock Edition. This is actually pretty crazy, so definitely big thanks to the people that have created this. Well, let's go to take a look at some other guns. This is actually super fun. Also, when you go ahead and crouch, you can get better aim. So it's really like a real gun. So let's look for something. So I got better aim now. Let's go ahead and crouch. And I got the sight on me. I got the sight on me. Oh my goodness, this is target finder. <laughs> you weren't ready for that. But the next thing I do want to go ahead and showcase is the sniper. So right here is the AWP. So let's go ahead and work on our scoping skills real quick. There's a bunch of different guns. So keep this in mind. So look at this. So I believe you got a crown. Ooh! Oh, yo! Yo, we just... Yo, yo we just... We just hard scoped that thing. Okay, so let's see if we can pull out a quick scope. Oh, hold on. Oh! oh wait. Oh, wait, no, we just missed it. Oh! Wait, I'm gonna... Hold on, hold on, guys. We're gonna hit it with the 360 no scope real quick. All right, this is actually so bad. I don't know how this is actually. Can we? Oh not. Oh, oh no! We almost had it. We almost had it. All right. So yeah, it's not the easiest thing to go ahead and control, but it's actually super fun to have a sniper rifle inside of Minecraft. What? Wait. Okay, I see how it works. Okay, so we gotta. Here we go. Okay, so that's super powerful. We can just no scope things. But yeah, this is a very cool thing. Definitely recommend it. If you want to go ahead and aim, I recommend it like that. As you can see, oh, oh, can we get it? I think, oh, we're out of ammo. Yeah, we, we're, we're out of ammo. Actually, we're not. We're still good. Okay, so let's try the rocket launcher. Yes, our actual rocket launcher of Minecraft Bedrock Edition. So instead of actually going for the RPG, because I can't really find it at the moment, but we have a throwable grenade. This is crazy. We got to test this out. Okay, hold on, hold on, guys. <gasps> no, no way. No way, that is cool, guys. So look at that. It's basically a chain grenade, and it did a bunch of different... Oh my goodness, that is crazy. So this is probably one of the coolest add-ons that I definitely recommend going ahead and picking up. Go ahead and get this add-on now. This is actually just insane. So our AR, or not AR, but sniper rifle is actually going to reload it real quick. But this is just insane that we could snipe on Bedrock Edition. Just take a look at that. Ooh. 
we're just too nice of it. But anyways, guys, that's going to wrap it up for today's video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Hopefully you guys figured out how to get mods. I think it's actually pretty important to figure out how to do this. And this new updated way is definitely way better than that obsolete method with File Explorer. But anyways, I will see you guys next time on the next video. Bye.